Welcome to Midlife Matters, where we celebrate women's wisdom and wit. I'm Georgianne Lucier, your host, and I'm very pleased to introduce today's guest, a good friend, Kim Dwyer. Mm-hmm. So maybe we can start with the fashion show. I am the chair for the third year. This is going to be our 17th annual fashion show. One of our biggest challenges is to find our models. We have 16 models, eight men, eight women. Mm-hmm. They're all touched by cancer in some way. And when, when someone tells you that you have cancer, mm-hmm. you have to always put the past behind and look forward. Not only do you have to worry about your treatment, with whether you are treated with chemotherapy or radiation, you want to treat the, your whole being. You, those were the ideas that Ellen had in mind when she formed the Looking Forward Foundation in 1994. And she had run this fancy fashion show. So I went a few times, mm-hmm. and little did I know that five years later, I would be in the fashion show as a model because mm-hmm. I was go- undergoing uh, breast cancer treatments. And I was 47 when I was diagnosed. In a big venue where there's food and music and fashion, um, just can't help but give people a sense that you know the journey continues yes right it's it's a great night out it's mm-hmm. this year it's going to be on monday june 3rd i'm going to be at anthony we have over 500 people that come and it's a, a great way to come out and and see survivors and celebrate life and it's i want to point out that it's not only breast cancer patients okay it's all kinds of cancer patients the looking forward program supports um, gives out information and support to all patients um, usually when a patient is diagnosed with cancer, it's one of the first things I received is a patient resource book. Mm-hmm. It's a three-ring binder, and it tells you everything you need to know about looking forward. And I like to say that your doctors will take care of your mm-hmm. chemotherapy, your radiation, your mastectomy, whatever, but looking forward will take care of the rest.